are turned in here tonight. That is what they will be. EA Sports. It's in the game. Well, there is no denying this man's striking credentials. Prevailing wisdom is he's going to try to keep this fight standing tonight. He has to. You know, this is what got him to the show. It was being able to use the hands to set up the kicks. We all talk about the high-level boxing background of this young man. But as he's developed, he's developed great knees. Yeah. He's developed great timing, great counter skills, and also the beautiful right high kick. The right high kick is something he hides very well as he follows with a jab right hand left hook. High kick comes over the top, and he can put you to sleep. No doubt about it. He will try to put on a striking clinic once again here tonight. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. So two years, the gap in age, with some differences in height and a similar reach. All right, now for the official introductions, we send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon is Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas, Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 146 pounds. Fighting out of Olympia, Washington, Dollar Bill. And now, to see his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. All right, so here we go with the start of round one. I can tell how excited you are for this matchup. Seems to be a slightly advantage on one side, but maybe not. This is a big-time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big-time athletes? Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Landed that knee to the midsection. Got to think his opponent's going to feel that one in the morning. And he's going to continue to throw that strike because he knows that his opponent can't take many of them. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. This is with that punch. 
trying to double up on that jab. Escape DC. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes on your opponent. Look at him chopping the woods. Chop the woods with those leg kicks. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. How about that chin? See, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to keep you on his feet right now. Lands with a right hand. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Big power shot there. Oh man, head kick lands. Just misses with the jab there. Big punch lands over the top. I was gonna follow this one. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg. Ooh. Trying to establish that jab once again. Liver kick. Straight punch lands. And now they are throwing both sides with lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean this fight is about done. He's got a hurt very bad Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. All right, side control now. We'll see if he can advance position. A lot of top pressure being applied here. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Down into his mouth. Outstanding ground and pound here. Somewhat of a lost art in MMA, at least in terms of making sure that every strike counts. Not an issue for him. He's making every single one of them count. He is not pity patting not touching. Every punch that lands, he wants you to feel it. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Final seconds here in round one. Big body kick lands. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. High-level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K-1 level right. kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on. All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't throw it full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him... Whoa! Whoa! Over the top, the 
This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent. But low. And now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, straight right. Big kick lands. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside legs. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Lee's kick attempt, they're blocked. Beautiful strike. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Nice land with the knee. You see the taller fighter having no issue getting the limb to the target there. Oh, big head kick there. Cable inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. Another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Nice punch by Lee. Just misses with a left hook there. Oh, there he goes, attacking that lead leg to the outside. Nasty kick there. Nasty leg kick. You gotta slow down your opponent. He knew his opponent wanted to move a lot tonight. This is the first step in getting him to slow down and fight at your pace. Well, some fighters, when they get cracked in the mouth, they respond well. He got stunned earlier in the round and hasn't really recovered or gotten back into things. People react differently, right? Some people just get back on. He's having a hard time building his way back into this fight. As he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Real nice body kick land. Just missed with that right hand. And they separate. Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming, or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. Lee gets caught with that punch. Hey, oh, hey, hey, that's hey. the hit score. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Now he's on top of him looking for a finish. Well, any time you are in a ground-fighting situation with this fighter, you're potentially playing with fire. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. All right, it's a good ground and pound by him here, certainly staying busy, and not just busy, but effective. You can just throw punches to keep the referee off of you. This guy is throwing punches to be effective, to throw damaging strikes. He's doing a fantastic job. Nice punch lands over the top. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Another shot lands upstairs. All right, he engages in a single power tie here. And they separate. Just misses there with the left. Big kick lands. Oh, that straight punch is going to be a real problem if they can't make the adjustment. A real problem. He needs to move his head defensively if he's going to avoid getting hit so many times to the face. So the crowd voicing its appreciation after that round. We had a knockdown courtesy of a punch midway through. DC, here's your highlight. It was straight. He threw him in combination and landed that big punch that really did hurt his opponent. Lesser men would have been done. He's got a tough guy in front of him. He will have to go back to this again. He will have to get back to this action if he wants to get the desired finish. You ready to fight? Ready. 
Third round underway. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Beautiful kick. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Devastated body kick lands. What a body kick. Now connects with a right. Oh, and he lands it on another knee. And sometimes it pays to be the taller fighter, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Good punch, Lance. Powerful leg kick, Lance. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. And he landed the right hand there. That punch, no good. Big body kick. Just out of range with that left hook. Nice leg kick. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Whoa! Oh, he's hurt bad. Kick home, and now his opponent in a roller trip. Such a sneaky head kick. He did not recognize it was coming high, and now he's got him hurt bad. Nice kick. Able to check that kick as well. Stuffs the takedown without issue. And they separate. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds. And it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fight. Oh! Oh, worked hard to get up again, but he looks like he's compromised. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. Oh, lands that punch. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damaged. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, big left. An uppercut in. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Oh, big head kick. Well, that kick landed the body beautifully placed right underneath that elbow. Let's see if he makes the adjustments now defensively to avoid opening up that midsection to further damage by that kick. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Holy smokes! What a performance! Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent Holy saw it coming, and before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. Well, we'll take a look back at the highlights. You know we're gonna find that nasty head kick somewhere in this highlight rip. Just an incredible result for him here tonight. A very nice head kick to finish the fight, but don't ignore all the work he did with his hands and give credit to the opponent. The opponent was in there every step of the way. And in order to get a fight of the night like you got tonight, both guys have to be willing to participate. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 38 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Dollar Bill. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And that'd be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight he did exactly that. Congratulations.